Hey, it's Dude. Let's go to the Fresno Chaffee Zoo for another random adventure. You come crew with us too. Buenos days, crew. I feel like a lot of these uh, zoo adventures were starting off like in this clip, just like that. Yeah. I know. I know it's the entrance, right? I don't know what we're doing here today. I mean, we're at the zoo doing zoo things, but there's no rhyme or reason of anything, only because, as you can see, can you see up in the sky, crew? Look at all that. Look at. There's nothing. Well, there is. There's clouds. No, there's no sun. Okay, there's no sun, yeah, yeah. And it feels amazing out here. Not hot at all. You could literally, we could stand right here right now and it'd be just fine. So we came on Thursday specifically for the king vultures that are on display now and then also the red tail hawk. But I guess today is vulture day, vulture awareness day. Jason hasn't seen the vultures yet. So let's go see some vultures. Let's go appreciate some vultures. So I see some keepers over there by the vultures. I don't know if they're doing anything specifically for the vultures. Here's one of them. Oh, the other one's back there. Oh, look, all three of them right here. The laughing place lives on. The laughing place does live on. Oh, that's and it lives, whoa, look at here it comes. And it lives on here in Fresno. Whoa, that was cool. Oh, the red hawk's right above. Right there. They are huge. Oh, look, he's like, hey, what is that? I want treats. Oh, look, look, they're, they're, <laughs> they're running. They're thinking maybe we're gonna get a something. Oh, look at, look at. Oh, I think that's for the red tail hawk. But the king vultures are getting excited. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, that was crazy. That was so loud. You could feel the air. It's being called down. This is cool. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. We're seeing feeding time crew. It's King Vulture Day today, but the red tail hawk right now is taking the show. Crazy. Oh my gosh, they climb. I missed that. But that was crazy. That dude was right there and literally started climbing up. <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. Right? Spider vulture. Give me that. Give me that. It's another bird day, crew. The uh, vulture got out. <laughs> it was pulling on the door so much. That they look, there they go. They're like, yes, don't worry about it. There's another enclosure, Dilly, so it's not like they're free out. Mischievous birds. <laughs> Shows how smart they really are. Right? Or problem solvers. Yeah, I mean, definitely smart. Definitely problem solvers. Oh, or actually, no, I think she did it on purpose. They did not get out like that. It was done on purpose. Because now that I see the lock, there's a lock hanging on the outside part. So it was, it was so they could be fed. I got it. I got it. Still, though. Still, oh, they know to open? yeah, that because it still opened the door, <laughs> it pulled it. That's funny. I'm just looking at this. I don't know if this was done on purpose or not. First, I'm thinking like it's not done on purpose. The reason why we got these right above, so it could have fallen when they were doing the concrete. But would they leave it like that? I don't know because then there's also this that looks like a giant feather, yeah. right? Specifically, this looks like a feather, so maybe it's done on purpose. That looks like emu. Emu feet. So then maybe it is on purpose? Not maybe. Of course that's on purpose because it's not like a, a emu was walked around by accident right here. But there's a stick. So, hmm. So, not construction update at all, but windows are in, crew. Frame, window. I think when I showed you the King Vulture Dilly, I showed you the side paneling over here that's on there now. But we got windows in there now. Looks like the building's closed. Wow. You know what I've never stopped to look at? Well, I guess you would know right now because I'm showing you, but this. I haven't actually stopped to look at this. It looks really cool. They should pressure wash it, repaint it. This is right at the entrance when you walk into the tropical rainforest dilly. But different people who I'm assuming have donated to 
Well, there's a Girl Scout, Troop 2020. That's very recent. I was gonna say, maybe this is only for anyone who donated for the this aviary. Ow. Jason poked me from behind. Or maybe they, I don't know, maybe they, the Girl Scouts, or maybe you could continue to donate to this. That was awesome. We just saw Sarah May, who gave us the backstage tour about three weeks ago, I think now. And then the other zookeeper that then tagged along, I forgot her name. I really love this spot. So cool. And cool. And then you look up and you see the tiny tree flamingos. They're not flamingos. We're gonna leave now. Later, Gator. Can you get the joke though? Yeah, oh, I got it. I got it. I definitely got it. These guys are such pigs. <laughs> <laughs> He's on one today. Look at how nimble they move. Very delicate. They have giant teeth. And they're hiding. They look all cute. <laughs> they are not. I remember the first time when uh, one of them was getting a drink of water. Yep, getting a drink of water from the dilly and you see its mouth open and you see those tusks. I don't know if I've ever seen this guy in here. Uh, I think it's a kookaburra. I think. They're usually on the other side over there with the kangaroos. That is nuts. I don't know if I've seen them this close. It had its, its bill and its wing, but something over here fell. It made a loud noise, so that's why it... Uh, what was that? Build. Boat. Build. Heron. It, the build does look like that, but... The body. The bot. The bot. Well, I don't know about the body. Just the color doesn't look like that. That's for sure, right? Yeah, I don't think that's the same bird. Maybe it's like the oh, how peacock. Yeah. Like the guys. Are all, all true. Or this could be a girl. That's true. This could be a male. The other one could be a female. The one on the picture could be a female. A very astute observation, Jason. I don't know if that's how you say that, but look at the majestic flamingos. Everything is majestic, they I can, know. They could probably just walk right up here. Yeah, they definitely can. <laughs> they could walk up over there too, up to that one if they want. Oh, yeah. But they know. Like, uh-uh. People are crazy. People are crazy. So they ain't trying to get close. And look at that. You get to see little sparrows Sticky taking a bath. bath. You want me to see them really close? It's okay. They're birds. Man, there's so many. Oh my gosh. This is like a sparrow hangout area. They're right here in the water. Oh my gosh. Again, crew, if you get excited of the little things in life, you can find it very exciting. These are different. Look at it. I haven't seen these two. Maybe I've seen that one, but I don't know about these two. We have some pennies and quarters. We don't have those two for sure. Which one are you going to do first? The wildebeest? All right, cool. Do it to a large. And always remember, do the Gary C technique. Gary C technique. There you go. Yep, yep. There you go. Meerkat. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Let's see that meerkat. Nice. It's a little, little weirdy. There it is. So they had, right there, as you saw as we were walking up, vulture something. They had like a chart. I think a feather of a vulture. But there was a lot of people gathered around that table, learning a lot about vultures, getting a lot of information. And I didn't want to put the camera in anyone's face or like just write up like, hey, excuse me, I'm going to record something. So that's why I didn't get that. But they had stuff right there showing you some stuff. So I was noticing and it looks really cool. The zoo, I don't know if you can see that behind us. There's a good amount of people here. I was just like, man, there's, just, there's a good amount of people. I love seeing that. But just randomly? No, there's... Uh, What's, what, what's this weekend? What? Labor Day. There you go. That's what's happening. So that makes sense. Got it. I was just thinking it was randomly. Like people just decided that, hey, it's not hot. So let's get out to the zoo and check that out some awesomeness. That could be part of it too, for sure. But also, I think the ma most major part is the weekend. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get this again. If I can get it right this time again. We're here at the Kudu Cafe. And something I just noticed over here, I'll show you right now. That's what they got. I've never noticed that. Yes, crew, it is right. We done it again. We got some good coffee. 
I don't know what, what we're doing, where we're going now. So the Italian soda is a regular soda dilly. As Jason said, you can get a Dr. Pepper and then they add in some flavoring. Cherry, mango, pineapple, uh, watermelon, coffee, uh, coffee soda. Mmm, they don't do that at all. But that's what would be an Italian soda. He is now a man. Yeah, that is a man now. That's not a baby rhino. Look at it. On his own. Wandering around. Now going back, you know, but... Just doing... His teen things. This is an amazing view right here. This view right here was the view that, like, got me very... Oh, this is this is a very different zoo when I first came. Look at the elephant. You just noticed the elephant? The kudu, is that what it is? The kudu, I'm not sure. You got the rhino, then you got the dude all the way back there. Yeah, it looks like a deer, but it's not. And then look at, here comes the other one from all the way back. There's more other whatever dillies. Here comes the sun. Doo -doo 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 -doo. That was perfect. Again, one of those things that I get intrigued by very easy. I mean, first of all, look at the flowers. Very nice. But you see this right here? This, uh, this border thing of where these planters are? I don't know if maybe a statue of something was supposed to go here. Because you see how that's like that? It's not just like ground. It's not just a planter. See how that's a planter? Or just dirt, right? Edge of dirt. And then here's concrete. That just makes me think if maybe something was supposed to go there. Last minute change. Nope. All right, this time we might have some more time. This time we might have some more time. Right, Jason? Because look at again. Yeah, we got the help from the clouds. We're not standing in the heat. Just sitting here staring. And there's no glare. Yeah. Watch, I'm still probably not going to find it. A reminder, if you see a clip like this and then no turtle, it's because I didn't find it. There's the betas. Beta right now. This one I thought was gone. It was laying on its side. L look at, look at, there he goes. But more on its side though. Almost upside down. <laughs> oh, there's a bee. Get away from me, bee. The betas have really, I think, become my favorite of this whole exhibit. The, the fish are schooling. <laughs> Oh look, they went right to Jason's finger. Look, try one for that. Whoa. That tortoise. I see a tree. But doesn't the turtle look fake? It's not fake, crew, it's real. And there it is. There's so many. That's not. Hiding in the corner. This is the best view you can get of it, because then. Uh, maybe a little bit more. There you go. Here they come. Oh, <laughs> the tigers up there. That looks amazing. It is awesome to see this land pack like this. They're also doing something with the sloth bear. Not too sure what. There's a lot of people in the way and I don't just want to get up in there, you know, and like, hey, look, I'm going to start recording. I'm just walking around. That was cool. I'm actually walking around just picking up Pokemon. Yeah, that was awesome. There's the elusive Yason. Right there. Right there. Having a good time. Enjoying some whatever. That was a random adventure to the Fresno Chaffee Zoo to go check out what the whole happenings with the vultures. I felt like I said vultures like a billion times. Take a drink of water every time. I said vulture, 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 vulture. But it was a fun adventure. I completely forgot I actually had this adventure in the library of iMovie. All I had to do was the intro, outro. A future zoo visit is in the plan, just not quite yet. We have the food review taco thing coming actually. When I was gonna edit that, that's when I saw that I still had this in the library. So let's upload this before I do that. But crew, thank you so much for hanging out. 
Seriously, you hanging out with us is something you never, ever have to do. You never, ever have to hang out with us. And I really, really appreciate every single second you give us. If it's one second or if it's all the seconds, I appreciate every single one of you. I appreciate, appreciate, but I really do. You're all awesome. Thanks for crewing. Thanks for adventuring. On to the next. There's going to be more videos coming. And they do that, just like that. Hope so. He's on poop on you. Dude, what's hell up there? How do you... It's not inverted. It's not Ooh. You got that up. <laughs> a laugh track and a... Way better than Kevin Hart, Tom Segura. Way better than those guys. Yeah. Should be getting paid twice as much as that paid you. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm done. <laughs> okay, he's done. <laughs> okay. Oh, wrong way. Nope. No, 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 no. I'm still recording. Oops. Alright, let's see. <laughs> but, um, I didn't spell it on my shirt. Okay. This is amazing. Um, this is... Poo -poo -poo -poo.